If it does, I want to be able to work with it. Once you seize it and trim it and cut it, now you got nothing else to work with. If you have to go back, make an adjustment. Now you got, you know what I mean. You just got a little bitter end down here, and you're trying to. It doesn't work. You got to keep enough to work with until you're, until you're ready, <clears throat> until you're done. In some cases, not everything. These shrouds, I know these are all done. These are fine. So trimmed and cut. But this is a piece of running rigging, and I just got a feeling I'm going to be adjusting this before I'm finished yet. I do think that I can cut these. I may put one more seizing on that for safekeeping. Wax. I talk a lot about wax, beeswax. There are ship modelers who won't use it. I don't know how they can do anything without it. I uh, I wax every piece of line that I put on a ship model, including these little seizing lines, including the shroud, everything. Every piece of line I put on a ship model is waxed. I do it because it helps protect the line. It keeps knots tight when you tighten them. Oops. That one broke. There's a little spot in this... <laughs> My dog, Maggie, Maggie died in 2012. She got a hold of this one day and started chewing. So every now and then you get that little spot where <laughs> Maggie had chewed. And it breaks on you while you're tightening the knot. Is that my second knot or was that my first of the granny? Shoys, 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 I don't know. Shoys, geez, I don't know. So I would put a little overhand knot in there. There we go. <laughs> Do you see that? That's just practice. I've been doing ship models since I was in eighth grade. The first ship model I ever tried was a plastic model of the USS Constitution. Cut my teeth on it. I finished it too. Built it in my bedroom in my father's house, Paradise Farm. Middletown. I need a, I can't find my, I got a thing of adhesive spray, flat adhesive spray, which works well for making sails look like they're full of wind and staying that way. I gotta get some of that later too. All right, we're gonna take a little break. We're gonna take what we call a station break. <laughs> Cheers. I'll come back and finish up some more later.